Sometimes the universe doesn't shout, it whispers. A faint shimmer in the dark, a subtle deviation in a trajectory, a flicker of light where no light should be. And yet, those whispers can shake everything we think we know. That is exactly what just happened with 3i Atlas. For months, astronomers believed they had cataloged its anomalies, 10 in total, a list already long enough to strain the edges of natural explanation. But now there are 12, two new signs, two new cracks in the model, two new reasons why scientists who once rolled their eyes at the idea of something non-natural are suddenly sitting upright, staring at screens with a mixture of awe and dread. And the images that came with these revelations, the ones from Neosat, from telescopes in Thailand, from New Mexico, from Europe, are not just fascinating, they are unsettling, because they show something that is supposed to be impossible. An object under extreme stress, firing jets in multiple directions, producing enormous tails, behaving with unnatural consistency, while remaining perfectly intact, not fragmenting, not tearing apart like a normal comet should. And when even Avi Loeb increases his probability scale, pushing it closer to the unthinkable, the astronomical world holds its breath. Because something just happened with 3 Eye Atlas, and it has left everyone stunned. The moment the new images of 3 Eye Atlas arrived, astronomers instantly understood. We were entering a new phase of this mystery. The Neosat image from November 17th alone was enough to unsettle even veteran scientists. It wasn't just a pretty picture. It was a forensic portrait. A side-by-side -side map of contour lines revealing a compact nucleus, unwavering, undistorted, unbroken. On the right panel, more than 40 intensity levels carved out the structure of the nucleus like a topographic map of a mountain that refuses to erode. To see a comet under that much thermal and mechanical stress remain whole is already bizarre. But the image in green hues, a nucleus glowing in yellow, surrounded by concentric halos that resembled magnetic field structures, hinted at forces shaping the coma in a way rarely observed. It looked organized, structured, almost held together by invisible hands. Meanwhile, from Thailand, the November 15th capture showed a comet not with a single tail, but multiple ones, including a prominent sunward tail, the anti-tail, a feature so rare and so geometrically demanding that its presence alone challenges expectations. And then came one of the most striking images of all, Satoru Murata's 8-inch telescope composite from New Mexico. A modest telescope, but what it revealed was monumental. Jets shooting simultaneously toward the sun and away from it, symmetrical yet chaotic, explosive yet controlled, delicate yet violent. These weren't the images of a dying comet. These were the images of something holding together against forces that should have shattered it long ago, something that refuses to behave like a natural object. For weeks, researchers obsessed over the 10 anomalies of 3i Atlas, 10 deviations from the expected behavior of a natural interstellar comet. But now the anomaly list has grown, not a little, enough to push this object close to the boundary between the natural and the engineered. Avi Loeb updated his page, identifying two new anomalies, bringing the total to 12. And these new anomalies don't just add to the mystery, they explode it. The first concerns the orientation of the jets. 3i Atlas is emitting collimated streams of material in directions that would require a ridiculously large sunlit surface area to sustain naturally. The math breaks instantly. The second anomaly involves the coherence of those jets over astronomical distances. They remain straight, stable, and collimated over 1 million kilometers, even though the comet is rotating every 16.16 hours. By all logic, the rotation should smear these jets into spirals or broad curves. Instead, they remain pencil-thin and unwavering. Loeb said it clearly. This behavior is inconsistent with solar-driven sublimation. And when he says that, he's saying something else between the lines, something earth-shaking. From the beginning, 3i Atlas was too big, too fast, and too chemically strange to sit comfortably in the natural category. But now, when we line up these anomalies together, the picture becomes even more extreme. Its nucleus is about 1 million times more massive than Oumuamua and 10 times more massive than Borisov, the two previous interstellar objects. That alone places it in the extreme tail of probability, less than 0.1%. But what makes researchers uncomfortable is not just its mass, 
It's what that mass is made of. The comet contains far more nickel than iron, something almost never found in comets and extremely rare in asteroids. Nickel and iron appear together in nature, especially in impacts. But nickel alone? That is industrial. That is manufactured. Loeb went further. The nickel-cyanide ratio is orders of magnitude beyond what we've ever observed. Not rare. Not unusual. More like impossible. Add to that its extreme negative polarization, something no known comet displays, and you begin to see why astronomers are running out of terminology to describe what they're witnessing. This isn't just a weird comet. It's something that violates the statistical and chemical norms of the universe as we understand them. If 3 I Atlas were simply strange chemically and physically, that would be enough. But its path is also wrong. Its retrograde trajectory is moving opposite the direction of the planets, yet it aligns with the ecliptic plane with an accuracy of about 5 degrees. That's beyond unusual. It's engineered precision. And the timing is even stranger. The object passed within tens of millions of kilometers of Mars, Venus, and Jupiter with a synchronization that borders on impossible. Loeb calculated the probability at 0.005%. Even more disturbing is its invisibility during perihelion. Its closest approach to the Sun occurred at an angle that made it unobservable from Earth. In other words, the object slipped behind the Sun at the exact moment Earth would have had the best chance to watch it. A coincidence? Maybe. But stack that with the anomaly list, and the word coincidence becomes harder to say out loud. One of the most defining characteristics of comets is water. Sublimation of water ice is what drives their activity. But 3I Atlas breaks that rule, too. Its plume contains only 4% water by mass, an impossibly low value for a comet producing this level of activity. And the glow. Near perihelion, it brightened faster than any comet ever recorded. Not fast. Not very fast. Faster than any known comet in the database. And then there's the color. Its coma became bluer than the sun. Comets don't do that. Bluish tones appear occasionally under specific conditions, but this was beyond any recorded spectrum. Again, the numbers stretch natural explanations to their breaking point. Another major anomaly is its non-gravitational acceleration, a push acting on 3I Atlas that cannot be explained by gravity alone. This acceleration would require the comet to lose 15% of its mass, over 5,000 million tons, yet no debris cloud exists to justify it. This anomaly is essentially confirmed, and it means something is propelling the object in ways our models cannot simulate. Comets can accelerate due to jets, yes, but not without showing massive coma expansion, not without evidence, not without scars. 3I Atlas is accelerating cleanly, silently, without debris. That is not natural behavior, that is something else. The strangest irony of all comes from a comparison. Another comet discovered by the Atlas system, C2025K1, recently passed near the Sun and fragmented. It behaved exactly as a natural comet should under extreme heat and stress. Multiple debris pieces, clouds of dust, structural collapse. Yet 3I Atlas, under equal or worse conditions, remains solid, unbroken, unshaken, perfectly intact. If this were merely a question of physics, both comets should behave similarly, but they don't. One behaves like a comet, the other behaves like something designed to withstand the sun. Just when the world was waiting for NASA's data, everything went dark for 43 days due to the U.S. government shutdown. The Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter had captured images of 3I Atlas using its high-risk camera, but the release was frozen. Now that the shutdown is over, those images could be published but we still have nothing. Meanwhile, ESA refined the trajectory using ExoMars TGO and confirmed the object poses no threat to Earth. Yet that only deepens the mystery. If it's harmless, why the delay? Why the silence? Why the uncertainty? And why does the timing align with a moment when the object's behavior is becoming increasingly impossible to explain? All we know is this. 3I Atlas continues moving. The images keep sharpening. The anomalies keep growing. And as the object grows closer, the universe is beginning to reveal a truth that few are ready to confront. When we put together everything we've seen, the images, the anomalies, the contradictions, the silences, the strange physics, the impossible coherence, the story of 3I Atlas stops being the story of a comet 
and starts becoming something much more unsettling, the story of an object that simply refuses to behave in any way the universe has taught us to expect. Because comets fragment, comets degrade, comets lose coherence under extreme heat, comets do not fire pencil-thin jets that stay collimated over a million kilometers while rotating, comets do not produce chemical signatures that mimic refined nickel alloys, Comets do not line up their trajectories with planetary orbits with a precision that defies probability. Comets do not glow bluer than the sun, accelerate without leaving debris, or synchronize their arrival with the positions of multiple planets. That is not comet behavior. That is something else. Something we can measure but not yet explain. And what leaves everyone stunned is not a single anomaly. It's the combination of 12, each one improbable on its own, but together forming a pattern we can't dismiss anymore. A size and mass that shouldn't exist. A nickel content that contradicts nature. A water deficiency that challenges even exotic chemistry. A retrograde yet perfectly aligned path. An anti-tail pointing almost exactly at the sun. A synchronization with the WOW signal's origin. A brightening faster than any comet ever recorded. A 15% mass loss acceleration with no debris cloud. Jets tracking straight through space despite a rotation pattern that should scatter them into spirals. And now two new anomalies, the 11th and 12th, which all but force the scientific community to admit there is something deeply, fundamentally wrong with this object. These are not random deviations. These are systematic violations. Even the voices of authority fail to settle the dust. Elon Musk, trying to explain away the nickel anomaly, ends up contradicting known geology, known comet composition, known astrophysical facts. Even the brightest minds stumble when trying to fit 3 eye atlas inside the natural box, as if the object itself is pushing back against our explanations. And then there's the silence. The 43-day NASA shutdown delaying key images. The continued absence of the MRO high RISE data. The strange timing that always seems to place 3 eye atlas just beyond the edge of convenient observation. Even that becomes part of the story, not because it hides something intentional, but because it adds to the sense that every time we try to pin this object down, it slips through our fingers like dust through a beam of light. And that's the thing most people are beginning to recognize. 3 i Atlas is not acting like a comet. It's acting like a question. A question flung across interstellar space, older than our sun, wrapped in ice, nickel, cyanides, and contradictions. A question that challenges our confidence in what we think we know about interstellar visitors. A question that reminds us that the universe is vast, ancient, and full of objects older than the Earth itself. A question that forces us to confront the possibility that our models, elegant, beautiful, mathematically perfect, may be inadequate for something this strange, this ancient, this different. So where does that leave us? Exactly where humanity has always been in moments like this. Staring into the unknown, piecing together anomalies, trying to hear meaning in the static. If 3i Atlas behaves naturally in the next month, the story will settle. But if it survives intact, if it continues defying every rule, then Avi Loeb's words will echo louder than ever. We may have to consider that it's something more than a natural comet. And that possibility, whether terrifying or simply awe-inspiring, is now part of the conversation whether anyone likes it or not. If this breakdown opened your eyes to just how strange 3 i Atlas truly is, don't leave quietly. Subscribe, because the next update could change everything we think we know about this object. Give this video a like so more people can see the truth behind these anomalies. And tell me in the comments, do you think 3 i Atlas is natural? Or are we witnessing something entirely unprecedented?